all eyes now on that inevitable hike. But the politics of oil means that there is going to be a long list of options when the cabinet meets early morning tomorrow in New Delhi. Almost four options, all of them could be politically suicidal, but the government knows and the Prime Minister, economist Prime Minister knows that he has no option. Rajkumar Sahu compiles all those options to tell us why you will pay much more for petrol and diesel starting tomorrow. When Prime Minister Manmohan Singh chairs the cabinet meeting on Wednesday morning, he will have more than one proposal from Murli Deva's ministry to seek a consensus on the fuel price hike from his allies. And now that he's gone on record to say that subsidies can't be allowed to go up, NDTV has learnt that some of the proposals to be considered on Wednesday morning could be quite harsh. The first proposal. This is the most drastic. The government may want to hike diesel prices by 7 rupees and petrol by 9 rupees per litre. This allows the political appeasing option of a rollback of up to 5 rupees a litre. The second proposal could be a 5 rupee hike in diesel and 7 rupee hike in petrol with no option of a rollback. The third proposal sees the most simple math come into play for a 3 rupee hike in petrol and 2 rupee hike in diesel. And the last proposal sees the government thinking that LPG prices could also be hiked by 20 to 40 rupees a cylinder along with a 3 and 2 rupee hike on petrol and diesel. Is there a cabinet tomorrow on fuel prices? No, there is a cabinet meeting, but I do not know the subject. Subject will be known later on. Person will be known. The question now is whether any one of these formulas will be enough to stop the bleeding for the oil marketing companies. It is now clear that extra money will have to come from upstream companies, but most important is the massive public awareness campaign that the government is all set to unleash in leading national dailies. And this will focus on the rising international crude prices and talk of how subsidies have now crossed over 2 lakh crore rupees. It will of course also talk about how much the companies are losing and try to gain public sympathy by saying that the government hiked prices by much less than what it really should have. Dr. Manmohan Singh, the economist Prime Minister, may see enough reason why the prices of petrol and diesel should be hiked to the maximum. But this time around, the compulsions are not only economics, but political too. And that is why the government is actually pondering over so many options. But whatever the reason may be, that would be very difficult to undo the damage already been done to the Indian oil and gas sector and the economy as well. Immediately, Rajkumar Sahu for NDTV.